The annual event takes place in honor of St. Patrick's Day. City Arborist Stan Stone is one of many working to dye the river a vibrant green color. At 11 o'clock tomorrow morning, uh, the, the BPU will slow the dam down for us. Uh, the leprechaun will, will get down and touch the water with his shillelagh and turn the river green. Stone assures us that the dye used to turn the river green is eco-friendly and is completely safe. It's the same materials they use when they test the pipes and in the waterways and things like that, so it's it's really safe, uh, non-toxic. The annual tradition started around 20 years ago with the St. Patrick's Day Committee commemorating the history of Irish Americans in Jamestown. There was a group that formed, and uh, there's a monument right here, our Blarney Stone, that has the names of the committee at the time that did it, and they went and started with the Blarney Stone first and then came up with the idea of turning the river green. Jamestown is only one of a few cities in the country to turn a body of water green to celebrate the holiday. Mostly the bigger cities I've heard of. Uh, Chicago, out in El Paso, Texas, things like that. So it's, it's nice that we can do it here in Jamestown and we've been doing it for about 20 years now. In less than 24 hours, there will be hundreds of people lining the Shadowcoin River to watch this water turn green in an annual Jamestown event that's just going to keep on going. Bronson Rasmussen, WNY News Now.